the ball better today. That was a very big little game. Very little game with very few big plays in the run game. And to give up six sacks completely blows me away, you know, a couple of late. Um, you know, coming into the game, giving up 12 sacks in 12 games. Um, obviously, an average of one per game. And then to give up six today, and then only get one on the other side of the ball. Um, we didn't play very well. Questions for Coach? Raise your hand, and I'll point out right here first. Shows really quick when we get tired or, or guys get banged up. Rico came out and did a little bit of X-rays. Um, Chris, Chris Walker came out a little bit. Wes Brown was out. Um, I think that one within the first five plays of the game came out. And once that happens, we get we get thin really quick, and, and it shows up and worries me. You know, it worried me for a long time. When we go versus our defense, we put our second team defense in practice. And it's scary. And then Gerald got banged up on offense, and, and as soon as we get winning, there aren't a lot of answers to go to. So. But I thought we guys play with, with good effort. We got to go hit the road recruiting. We got a lot of spot to fill. It was very surprising to me. I thought we'd do well. Um, if, if there was anything that people had done okay versus something that was running the ball, nobody really threw the ball very well in all year long. Um, so I thought we'd be able to sustain uh, some more yards in that. But they did a great job. And you look at that defense, it, they had some struggles early. But they were phenomenal down the stretch the last four games of the year. They didn't give a point in the second half. And so, um, you know, they, they've, done, they've done a really good job. They do a good job of hurting their guys. Not the biggest guys, but they, they play extremely hard and they play very disciplined. Any questions? Yeah. You've been pretty aggressive with your play calling on your back on third down. It seems like you call a lot of the run play. Was it the pass protection breaking down? Or was it the pass protection breaking down? Yeah, we gave up six sacks. I don't feel like breaking a bowl record and giving up about 12. So if you had any good ones on third and 30 there on that last run, I'm going to be looking for ideas. But it, it were, you know, it was, it was, you know, that's that's a fast defense. And put them on the turf, they play really fast and they rush fast. And you saw we have six sacks, and so um, as crazy as it is to think, think of think what would happen if it wouldn't have been conservative at times like that. And so um, I, I thought it was going to be a field position game, and, and when we got into long distances, you know, we didn't want to try to force the ball down the field. And you know, one of the first passes of the game, we threw an interception trying to force it down the field. Okay, right here. So, um, you know, we don't have some of the same issues. Yeah. 
Coach, I believe only Ole Miss scored more than 30 points. What made that offense so much more challenging than I thought the quarterback played phenomenal today. Um, I thought he was on the money almost every time. I mean, he threw some ropes in there. I watched him in the warm-ups. He threw the same way. Um, I, I realized he was good um, running. I realized he was good throwing, but I didn't realize he was that good throwing the ball. Um, he was extremely accurate today. And their receivers really came up big. There's a lot of contested balls where it's right on the money. And our guys are right there, and the receivers made a bunch of plays. So hats up to them. There's, they're a good team. There's a reason that, that, that Texas is not the only two teams in the country now that have won 10 games six years in a row. It's a great program. Right there. You, guys, you guys face a lot of good running backs in the SEC. What is Williams great among the team this year? Well, I think McCluster. I don't go off our game with Cluster. He was the best that there was that day. Um, you know, this guy's done it all year long. You know, he didn't rest the week before. Um, you know, we played him the same way. This guy, no matter what, he could carry a ball. He can carry a ball 95 times a game. He can do that. So he, he's a big time back. I, I would imagine if the rules are different, this guy would be ready to go to the next level right now. Right there. Yeah, we, we were expecting him to take a shot, and, you know, for whatever reason, you know, we just weren't in the right spot. Coach, did our defense make adjustments on you second half? Did they move the ball? Or, uh... No, I, I didn't. We didn't move the ball that well all day, really. You know, um, we had some drives where we had some screens and, and hit a couple big plays. Um, so I thought they did a great job all day long. They were geared up to stop our running, so we were going to have to take some shots. And when we hit the shot early to Denarius, the big play, um, we come back with it with a play kind of similar to it where he drops it. And then some other times when we try to take shots on the field, we weren't able to hold up. So I just think that's the blueprint of what you have to do versus them is you're going to have to run the ball and take shots. Um, and unfortunately, we didn't hit any of them today, and we shouldn't have run the ball well. Yeah. Space one on one, and he's a great back, and we didn't do a good enough job on offense. Else right there. Well, I know you said you've been Yeah, they'll always be part of this process and what we what we've done. We wanted to finish better for them than when four in our last six. We wanted to make it five on our last six, and so I wish I would have been able to give them that and done a better job, but. I told them they'll, they'll be the same guys when we're playing in the same stadium for SEC championships. They'll be the guys standing on the sidelines with us, remembering they helped us start this. Last question. Come in. Coach, well, now that the season is over and I've played the last game, where do you rank the job you did and everything with all the expectations? Well, what, do you, what do you rank? I, I don't know. You guys are going to write about that tomorrow. So that's up to you guys. Thanks.